And since the storm is expected to hit along the northwest coast of Florida, we sent News Channel 8's Chef Patterson up there to cover it for you. Yeah, and he's joining us now live from Taylor County near Deadman's Bay. Jeff, how is it looking up there? Yeah, good evening, Stacy and Josh. We're in Steen Hatchie right now, and timing is everything in covering a storm like this. Right now, it's uh, cloudy here, but not rain. We did drive through some extremely heavy bands of rain on our way through he up here, uh, up US 19 through uh, Homosassa, Homosassa Springs. You could barely see in front of the car. But right now, let me just show you Dead Man's Bay. Uh, this is after high tide, high tide about 3 p.m. here. But the wind has already pushed this bay into uh, the water up into the Steenhatchee River here. Uh, well, let me show you some video that we shot a short time ago. A Taylor County Sheriff's deputy advising us of some local street flooding and we went over there and of course we did see some homes that are already surrounded by water they're up on stilts the people here have been through storms before they know what to expect but they are keeping a very close eye on Colin right now it isn't too bad um, we're buckling down waiting on the wind to come but right now we're just looking at the water levels and making sure the boats don't flood and that's about it yeah, we have seen some people uh, making sure that their boats are safe and secure out here. We talked to a restaurant owner. They tried to stay open as long as they could, but they are closed down right now in anticipation of this storm, which is supposed to hit just north of where we are right now in Steenhatchee. And we're expecting the tidal flow, the winds, to be uh, the worst on this side of the storm, which is why we are in Steenhatchee, just kind of waiting for uh, Colin to come on shore around 8 p.m. Stacy and Josh. Yeah, that is an uneasy feeling, the waiting period before it hits. All right, Jeff Patterson live for us yeah. near the spot where the eye of that storm is expected to hit land. Thanks, Jeff.